on the twelfth day of Christmas, Santa said to me, You are naughty girl. Oh, thank you, Santa. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Marky, and today we're going to be talking about some exciting stuff. So I just have to fill you guys in. So I shopped completely on Amazon for Christmas. I like bought my kids everything from Amazon like for Christmas, right? You know, a lot of people have really good luck on Amazon. That is me. Some people don't. They just can't find the good deals, can't find, you know, good toys or whatever it may be. Or you're just not putting in the right... He got in the back of the truck. You're just not putting in the right keywords to find what you're looking for. And uh, I am in here because I have to hide what I'm saying from my kids. Um, the cabin is not safe. The windows are open. You can hear through the walls. It's not safe. So here I am telling you my exclusive gifts I got for my kids off of Amazon. Okay, so the first thing I got for my daughter was a Van Top Junior K3 kids camera. And you're probably like, what the heck is this? It's like a GoPro, okay? It is fully equipped to be dropped, to be stepped on, to have stuff banged on it. It's video or camera, which like my daughter has been saying like she wants a GoPro because she wants to make videos like mommy, which I think is so cute. Like, how can you not think that's cute? She wants to be just like me. Um, so I found that and I'm like, oh my gosh, for the price, it's 40 bucks, 40 bucks. And I have Prime, so I get free shipping. And normally I would never buy my daughter some kind of electronics like that. She's six. I don't think she's very responsible to be taking care of some kind of equipment like that. But that's four kids and it's perfect because she can make her videos, take her pictures. Like I was super stoked when I saw that because I was trying to find, you know, she had said she wanted a GoPro and I'm like, there's no way, honey, you're not getting a GoPro if I don't have a GoPro. Um, but a camera and it's can make videos so you, it's a it's a win-win situation like she's gonna freaking love it um and to go with that i also got well i guess not to go with it but she likes to do these little news stories um and she's been saying she wants a microphone so i'm like okay i'll see if i can find a microphone so i have found a microphone so this is a bluetooth and wireless microphone so she can play it from like my iphone like music on it she could just use it to talk in or i'm pretty sure she could even connect it to her tablet because it's got bluetooth so i found this and i'm like oh my gosh and it was pretty cheap too decent price 32 bucks is not god awful um i've learned cheaper is not always better and expensive is not always better so i went ahead and kind of splurged a little bit got out of this microphone um, I think she's really gonna like it and she can, you know, use it for her videos. Now this year, uh, we did kind of splurge a little bit. Um, we kept Christmas around $300, so we spent $150 per kid. Um, we just wanted to have a nice Christmas this year. Everybody deserves it, so, and we kind of bought more of the high-end items, like, well, actually, I don't I don't even want to say that because these gifts really weren't that expensive. Um, but this next one, now this is for, you know, probably any age from, I don't know, three up, to be honest, like it's a versatile gift. So any little girl who loves to do hair, loves to do makeup, like from experience, like I would freaking love this, okay? So I found this practice mannequin head, okay? Like look how beautiful that is. Like the hair reminds me of like, I don't know, unicorn hair, like all the stuff like the girls are into right now. Like, um, and it even comes in with the clip, like you can clip it onto a table or whatever. So you can, it sits upright so you can do its hair. Um, and when I was in beauty school, we had these, um, you can, you know, hot iron the hair, blow dry it, you can recolor it, uh, do whatever you want with the hair and the face, uh, you can do makeup on the face. It washes off. It's kind of like Barbie material plastic, right? And I say any age because, you know, if you've got a 16 year old who, you know, and I know at that age, they're probably really hard to buy for and it's probably easier just to give them money um, because I was 16 once. Um, if they're into doing hair and makeup, I think something as simple as this head to like practice on, I really think would be a really good gift. And it's 20 bucks. I mean, you can't go wrong for 20 bucks for a head that you can cut up, color, you know, hot iron, whatever you want with. So I was pretty excited because she's to the age where she likes to do hair, she likes to do makeup, um, and it's really good to help her with her her muscles in her hands like you know sensory things not that she has sensory issues but I think it will help her you know even 
I don't know what I'm saying. It's just freaking cool, so I got it. Okay, now this next gift, I had in my cart, right? I had in my cart because I've been planning this whole like shopping haul out since like Sunday. And I put it in my car, it was in there for like two days and I wake up the next morning to check and make sure my stuff is still good. And it was, it was sold out, it was gone. Now just for this color, now these, th these items are still available in different colors, different types, right? So originally when I started doing my Christmas shopping on Amazon, I was going for like the old school toys, right? Like I was super stoked because these kids nowadays do not know how good we had it back in the day with all of our cool ass toys. Like, can I get an amen? Like, okay, so let me show you what it was. A freaking Tamagotchi! Like, who wouldn't like this? Like, you know, kids love like little virtual pets, stuff they don't actually have to take care of. Now the one that I wanted, well there was two of them that I flipped back and forth, but they both sold out. So the, you know, this one, I like that, that shiny metallic, like silver color, like I like that. The other one was like a pink, blue, green, rainbow one, right? Like it, it just suited my daughter because she's all into that crap, right? Um, now they have different variations. They have blue for boys yellow black red you know every color you could ever want they got even fancier ones right for like 50 bucks but i wasn't willing to spend 50 bucks on something that fits in the palm of your hand right that um she'll probably not play with after like the first week so um i didn't get that but anyways i didn't get this gift i wanted to get it but they sold out and it wasn't going to be available until after january so it just didn't work but this was an idea this was what i was going to get so anybody who you know maybe wants to do some old school stuff this would be perfect and then i and then i got her a barbie dream card because my father-in-law bought her a freaking Barbie house like this little girl has been asking for a Barbie dream house for like the past four years right and you know the first year she asked <laughs> we got her like a knockoff one and it didn't last like it broke and then we just could not spend like the hundred and fifty dollars on one gift just we just couldn't do it so she never got one well he got her one so I got her a dream car and y'all you already know what those look like so anyways so on to the boy so these next two items I'm going to show you, there's just two of them because uh, the one I had to order off of Walmart because <sighs> Amazon sold out. I actually had to change it. So originally I was going to buy the Paw Patrol, um, the car, the bus, whatever that is, okay? Uh, and it was $30 cheaper than it was at Walmart on Amazon. Had that in my cart, sold out. So I exchanged it for um, the Paw Patrol cop car with all the dogs, okay? got that um and then i i believe do i need that i'm gonna have to look at that because i also got him the figurines but the paw patrol car comes with the figurines so i'm gonna have to change that up oh crap i already ordered oh crap oops you can't have too much paw patrol can you Nah. Anyways, okay, so I got that for him, and then the extra little characters. Um, now the next thing, and I totally spaced it when I was like looking for something for him because my daughter's really easy to buy for. Like anything girly, she likes it. Now him, on the other hand, he doesn't really play with toys. Like he's okay with just watching the tablet. So he's kind of challenging. And now I found Paw Patrol, I found Thomas stuff. Um, you know, stuff like that he likes that I know, but I completely spaced. He has been really big into Octonauts. Do you guys know Octonauts? Like, they're the shit, right? Um, and last time that I really looked into Octonauts was when my nephew was little, you know, like two and three, because he liked Octonauts, right? And they, it was a big thing back then. Um, now not so much. So I got to thinking, I'm like, Duh! He watches Octonauts. Let's get him some Octonaut toys. Okay, some Peso and and you know Quasi. So I found an Octonaut set on Amazon. Fifty bucks, people. Get you all the characters, the pod. Um, I think another little vehicle. Uh, you know, it was a really good deal. And you just the, Walmart doesn't carry Octonaut stuff. Not that I know of, at least not my Walmart. You know, uh, there's no Toys R Us because they went under. So it's really hard to find these toys. So this to me was a good deal for all those characters in that big set. I was like, yes, he's gonna freaking love it. And I was really excited to get away from like the Paw Patrol and the Thomas, to be honest. Okay, so the next thing that I got my son, um, once again, really hard to buy for. I never know what to get him. I don't know what he's gonna like because he doesn't play with stuff but I found something because he also has an obsession with the Incredibles he loves those Incredibles so I was browsing 
I thought, walkie-talkies, let's do walkie-talkies, because, you know, who doesn't love freaking walkie-talkies? And I come across incredible walkie-talkies. Now, I could have got Paw Patrol or, you know, whatever, but Incredibles? Incredibles? You can't go wrong with Incredibles, so I found me some incredible walkie-talkies. Here they are, folks. Look at those bad boys. $17 does the trick. So I really think he's gonna like those and I claim those are a deal. You know, Walmart has some walkie-talkies, but I can never just find anything good at Walmart. You know, and not for a decent price. I walk out of there feeling like something, you know, I, you know what I'm saying. You know, I tried to keep the price, the price range pretty close, four gifts each, and then we bought clothing as well. Um, my daughter's gifts were probably more of a I mean, she didn't get more than him, but they were probably a nicer gift, but she's not hard on toys, she don't break her stuff, and she's easier to buy for. Him, he don't play with toys and he breaks everything. So I think he'll be content with that. Um, and then we'll get them some stuff in their stocking, you know, some little like surprise packs, stuff like that, which actually you can buy that on Amazon too. Amazon has lots of surprise packs, but I didn't go that route because I spent my limit. This is why I had to come in the truck. I literally have no privacy, no privacy. Um, to wrap these gifts, I'm gonna have to clear a spot in the camper and do it in the camper and lock it. Cause Beavis and Butthead back there. Well guys, that's my video for today. Leave me a comment, let me know if, uh, if my ideas were good. Like if you think my kids will like those, if your kids would like those. I think my kids would like those. And if you like this video, leave me a big thumbs up because that makes me know that you love it so loud anyways and if you want to share it to your friends and family and just show them the awesome deals Amazon has like I love Amazon um, I buy everything from Amazon clearly so yeah anyways thanks for watching and until next time